Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Serrano and today we're going to be taking a look at the Motorola G Power 2021 update to Android 11. But if you're brand new to the channel, I truly appreciate you for coming through if you're new. And if you're already a part of the crew, I truly appreciate you as well. But um, make sure you subscribe and get notified for more videos just like this. And if you're already a part of the crew, salute. Alright guys, so today I did want to talk about the Moto G Power 2021. This is a solid device, 6.6 .6 inches on the front of this display. We're also getting a nice um, plastic texture, which is not going to have any fingerprints on it. Side mounted fingerprint sensor, volume rocker right above it, headphone jack and microphone up top, as well as type C and microphone below and mono speaker. Um, we also are getting a 5,000 milliamp hour battery on here. 720 by 1600 HD plus display 20 by nine LCD IPS display as well. And um, you can see right here, it does say Android 11 is here. Experience the new Android. So let's go ahead, unlock the device. And you can go to the update section right here and you can just check it out right here, what it will incorporate, right? So new version, the RZB31Q2. 143727. It's 1.44 gigabytes and it's Android 11. It says say hello to the powerful and new device and media controls and communications communicates more easily with conversation tab and chat bubbles and choose how and when your data is shared and one time permissions and um, new privacy settings and stuff like that. So um, that's pretty much what it's going to say. We're just going to hit update now and then it's going to tell you that you can go ahead and download it. And you can check out all the features right here just by hit, hitting this icon where it says check out all the features. And it's going to say everything right here. So conversations, chat bubbles, one time permissions, auto reset permissions, other improvements. Um, quick settings and media controls, new power features and power menu, changes to uh, recent apps, custom dark mode scheduling, screen recorder nearby share, do not disturb mode, and other system improvements as well. So after that, you just hit got it right here. And then it's just going to install that and you're just going to wait um, until it's actually finished installing and then I'll get right back with you. So just a quick thing to note, make sure you give yourself at least, you know, like at least two hours to, to actually install this thing. Cause it does take quite some time now. I've been here for a hot minute, but um, you know, it does take a minute to actually install. So it, let me just show you some of the things that's going to change the whole, the whole um, control center will change. You see how everything's up here. Um, you won't be able to actually, excuse me. Um, you won't actually be able to change like the icon shapes like you like you were able to here in Android 11, um, in Android 10 and Android 11. Um, it's kind of different. So let me show you what I'm talking about. So when you go into settings right here, when you go into, uh, let me see. You could change all your stuff right here, everything. But there's, there's, a, there's one thing called styles. And this is where you can change like the icon shapes, colors, everything like that. So that's that's available for Android 10. So I'm not sure if we're gonna still be able to have that for Android 11. It says right here, Android 12 rollout begins in February. And that looks like the Moto G Pure right there, which is kind of crazy. So, you know, a lot of devices are getting Android 12 coming up in the 2000 and, you know, 22 and stuff like that. But this one's just getting Android 11. So right now it's at 98% when it comes to the downloading. So I'm pretty much basically going to install this right here on my device right now and just let it, let it do its thing, let it install, let it complete. Everything is pretty much finishing up right now, as you can see right here. But the Moto G 
power 2021 is getting the android 11 update and i already always knew this phone would get it i always knew this phone has some real good power to it just felt really good in the hand uh 10 watts fast charging you know 15 watts fast charging 10 watts charger in the box but you know really solid device right here but let me just wait for this to actually complete and everything like that all right guys so android 11 so it says restart now your device in 30 in 90 seconds to restart and it's going to basically have that update available so let's just go ahead and do that i'm going to go ahead and restart the phone and wait for the system software update to actually install on the moto g power 2021 all right guys so it is actually installing into the phone i'm just waiting for the screen to boot back up but i did get a new animation here and um let's just wait for the actual screen to turn on on android 11. all right guys so the screen just did turn on for android 11 so i'm going to enter my password right in here hit enter and then now let's just check out the new android 11 for the moto g um power 2021 right now and um i'm waiting for it to uh, load up the screen right here so it says finishing system update right here at the top you can see it says loading the effects and things of that nature i still get my modified uh i even get the gif maker on here that's crazy you still get the boost space effects you still get the icons it says what's new you can create custom profiles for each audio device each time you connect okay so that's kind of crazy I, I like that feature and you can customize the eq one there and then it says right here congratulations you've successfully uh, connected successfully installed the android 11 uh august 1st 2021 chat bubbles um not now it says you could you can install chat but you got all these features on here control center let's go down and you get all these features in addition to the ones that are already there on the bottom right there so you can see that screen recorder i should probably add that one because screen recorder is pretty crazy And then let's just check out something on the home screen real quick. Styles, you still get your option here to change the styles. So that's still pretty cool. So really good on Android 11 for the Moto G Power 2021. I'm gonna actually test this for a little bit of time and then get back with you on how it feels overall. But it's definitely pretty cool that it did come to this device because I was definitely looking forward to Android 11 on the Moto G Power 2021. But thank you guys for coming through, showing your support and appreciation, and I'm gonna get right back with you, and I'll check you guys later. Peace.